Hey, how's it going, everybody? Welcome back to Fish and Grills. We got a bunch of fish to cook up, as usual. We also got sponsored this monster moy from our friend Dre. He hooked it up for us, so we're gonna cook it for him and feed it to our people. Hey, everybody, thank you for tuning in. We're gonna get our grill ready for the kala and the pawalu. We're gonna get those set up as poo poos, and then we're gonna get ready for the moy. Stay tuned. for this episode of Fishing Alright guys, time to clean this monster moy. Look at that, colossal. Have you seen a moy that big? My god. Alright guys, this is the moy, also known as Pacific Threadfin. The moy is known in the Hawaiian Islands as the Fish of Kings. Once upon a time, this fish was only allowed to be served to Hawaiian royalty, the king, queen, and their staff. This fish was so important to the kingdom that they had to build fish ponds to farm this fish to sustain its population. This fish can be found worldwide in tropical and in subtropical waters, belonging to 40 different species, appearing in a shiny silver body with a large fork tail, two dorsal fins on top and bottom, and long thread-like whiskers. They're usually traveling in large schools near shorelines, over sandy areas, and muddy brackish waters. Moy feeds on small fish, worms, and crustaceans. This fish can grow up to two feet in length, and the Hawaii state record come in at 10 pounds, four ounces, caught off the shores of Kauai back in May, 2008. Some fish skeletons. Looks like a baby Owama. Some more fish bones. So that's the pretty much small fish. So if we're trying to catch these guys, a small fish will probably do. The moi is arguably one of the best tasting reef fish in the world. It has extremely soft, flaky, sweet, rich meat. Just prepare them, bake, steam with your favorite flavors. Boom, 45 seconds. Oh, I missed the freaking oh. beak. Oh. <laughs> Mm. Now this is a process called poaching. It's a cooking technique that involves cooking by submerging food in a liquid and having it sit in a temperature just below boiling for an amount of time. 
This method is particularly suitable for delicate food such as eggs, fish, and fruit. Poaching is often considered a healthy method of cooking because it doesn't use fat to cook. <laughs> So this is the guy who sponsored us the moi, Dre. Welcome back everybody. Our garlic is almost brown, ready to go. So we're gonna turn this off. We're gonna grab this, make sure you got a rag. I think it was, this handle was hot. Follow me. <laughs> Tap, crack one, pop. Be generous with it. Very generous. First taste right there. Oh my god, this is good, so good. First taste Let's go. <laughs> Thanks for watching this episode of Fish and Grill. Yeah.